what's your favourite? What do you like the best out of everything in here? Um, as I told you before, I think I, I I'm a, um, I've seen these products for so many years, yeah. uh, um, and now I'm a little more happy for the um, for the products from seventeen, uh, yeah, eighties and nineties because that's also the products I've yes. grown up with. Yeah. So, um, but. It's, my favorite it's difficult to have a favorite yeah um, maybe it's the most rare one but that would be the uh, real bear <laughs> yes Liber. yeah um. what's the what's the earliest product you've got other than the eliminators can we talk about the the radios is it the five lamp yeah i four? guess it would be there I yeah ask my father about it but it's it's the old product here they yes. are they are the early early ones but as I mentioned to you, in the UK we just never see these. We don't have a lot of them in Denmark either. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> but it's good that so many have survived here and in the Struer Museum. We have picked them up all over. Yes. Yeah. It's, it's, it's difficult to find. Yeah, oh yeah. yes, I can imagine. In good condition also. And I love this gramophone with the, uh, the pull-out radio. There's no room for new channels. You can see the, tif the channels <laughs> were there already. So yes. you can't start a new radio station. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> it's not possible. <laughs> yeah. Let's see if we can focus on those. And, uh... So Master Deluxe 39, that would be a 1939 or 1938 model, wouldn't it? Mm -hmm. I guess. Mm -hmm. We've got wire recorders, microphones. Little radios. But you can have a look. Um, yeah. So but there's a, maybe you should get a, a view over this so you can see what's have to go through. There's more. Yeah, of course. Wow. All the rooms. <laughs> I thought that was it. No, that, no, the first no, room I thought no. that was it. Wow. Start here <laughs> to see what this is what actually this is what started it. Because this is my um, my granddad's uh, table from his workshop when he yes. started dealing and repairing by Olsen. Wow. A lot of years ago. And that's records from his store. Yes. And there we have the yeah, uh, some of these. Yeah, yeah. Ron, Ron, now, how do you say it in Danish? Ron, Ron Strahler? Yeah, Ron Strahler. Ron Strahler. Yeah. So that was a little. And, and today the new speakers, 360. Yes, you that's know? right. But yeah. it's actually, we had it before. That's, that's yeah. the one. 1964, I think. If I we can see right. them there. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, that was a 360 degree tweeter. Yeah. I just love the woodworking, the, the grain on the wood here is incredible. This is it's a really beautiful piece of furniture. Yeah, they are. Again, craftsmanship at yes. that time. Yeah. And That's some it. of them we have here, we haven't had the time to, 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 to polish and make the finish, uh, but you can yes. use It's wood, so you can do a lot yeah. to, to, uh, to make them totally shine yeah. again. I know Gavin Sykes has got either the 600 or 601 TV. Yeah. I did a video with Gavin a year or so ago, and uh, this is. And, and um, I'm sorry for we are. It's a bit messy because we are changing some, something right. in, the, in yes. the what is called. It was the that one around. Um, but this is the nineties room. <laughs> I, I always love these phones. I think these these are incredible. The different colours. They'll never go out. Yeah, there's a lot of uh, different uh, yeah. variations. Oh yes, this is my era. Yeah, I've got the is. 3500 system at home. And the uh, VLAB 3000s. numbers of that amount of these I have oh, sold in my time yeah LX MX wonderful yes. televisions oh yes great sound picture design yes. 
I had an MX4000 for years and even up to about 10 years ago people would still come into the house and say wow that's a new TV isn't it? Yeah. I say no it's 20, 30 years off. <laughs> yeah it's not one. My first was an MX1500. Yes. The first MX television. Oh yes the little one. Yeah. Yes. It's, it was a small one but yeah. it was good for my little room. When yes. I I have to apologise to everybody watching this video. I, I feel I feel like a child in a sweet shop. This is amazing. <laughs> and I thought, well, the Struer Museum is incredible, but this is this is something I think even more special in it. In a way, this is just this is just the joy of collecting bang and Olufsen. Yeah, that's a it? that's a collecting. Yes, all the CDs and the the books and the mugs. I think every room should have beer lab painters. They can do something to a room. Yes. But they are back in, uh, in oh, business. Yes. They're back in business. Yes. Uh, the sound is there and of course the design. Yes. If you have a minimalistic um, uh, installation or other uh, furniture or something, they're just nice to have in there. Oh, I can yes. see that. Red line speakers. I do need to find some red line 7000. Yeah, we don't have them as well here. Uh, but I think we have them in the 140 in the other room. Yeah, oh yes. Yeah. Yeah. So now we can go to the 80s. I just can't believe the size of this collection. This is incredible. This just wow! <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> the video recorders. Oh yes. That time. There probably aren't many of these left because people threw away video yeah, recorders. They threw them away. They? Yeah. And and actually, um, now and then people come and. Uh, and Ask for for uh, for a VHS machine because they yeah. want to um, to play the the old tapes they have recorded uh, yes. maybe with the family uh, yeah. parties and something like that. So uh, and more MX TVs. Yeah, different versions yeah. of them. And it's so unusual to see the 6,000, 8,000 systems in white, with the matching white speakers. I don't think I've ever seen a, a set up like that. Oh yes, thoughts. that's the LX TV I think, isn't it? The, oh. oh no, sorry, it's the Beer Vision 8902. Yeah, yeah. it's older than right. the LX. Oh yes, yeah, because that that was the f one of the first stereo TVs, yes. wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. And then after that, it's split into LX and MX. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Ah, the Beer Cord 9000. So I've heard about those, but never actually seen one. The Vision M20, that's the one before the That's the MX. first one. That's the first one, yes. Yeah. It's the so first one of all. That. Yeah. The MX Solutions. Yeah. Let's start the era. Oh, not must. My dad is coming. Yeah. Hi. 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 Yeah. Um, it's actually, it looks like it sh should have been, um, you know, uh, with the front glass, but there, yes. was, there wasn't. No. no they were made like that. We show the yeah. two together. On the right, the MX with the smoked glass, and then the... M20. It's just it's the tube. Yeah. Mm. M2 there. Yeah. Okay. Even Bang and Olufsen skis. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> wow. I 
Welcome to the 70s. They oh. had the bill lids. Oh, yes. Now, I remember last time I visited your store in Brendale, these were on one of the walls, and that's, that's amazing, seeing all the colours together. All different models. Yes. Yeah. Models and colours. Wow. Well, then the Leo, the first, the first, oh, the, color, first. the first color television. The first, ah, the yeah, first yeah. color television. Yes. Yeah. yeah, that's right. Yes, Beer Vision 3000. Yeah. Yes. Wow. Oh, yes, that's my favorite. Beer Center 3500. Is that, that a, your favorite of that these? That was my first ever. So okay. BNO system. Okay, that's my own. Yes. But the one you have is that uh, the one you have from uh, from the start. You still have it? No, I um, I went to university and uh, when I came back it was gone. Oh. So I think it. someone had sold it. So I managed to find another, but it doesn't work. So one day, one day I've got to get it repaired. Yeah, yeah should have it. My my first one was the uh, uh, thousand seven seven hundred. Yes. The sender. Yeah. Oh, his, yeah, the beer center 7000. Yeah. And there's more. So, wow. Then, then there are some special edition. So, which of these speakers is that MS150? No. Uh, um, M one hundred. M one hundred. Yes. Yes. Yeah. For these. Yeah. Yeah. The other one is, you know, with the more than one part of the yeah. front. Yeah. What an amazing collection! It's really, really yeah. good. Yeah. Here you have the cubes. Oh yes, the cubes, the yeah. beer box 2500. And the beer up 5000. Yes. Also rare to have, you know, stuff there's a box. Oh yes. There's a radio in a box. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I love the beer lids. These are the earlier ones, aren't they? Yeah, yeah they are. From the sixties. Yeah. Also iconic. Yes. And just designed today still hold. Yes. Yeah. Oh yes. I think the new beer even the new beer lit twenty has got some parts of the design from these. I think you're right. They have been looking for yes. for the time before. Yeah. Oh, wow. So I'd better just take a step back and show another row of beer lids. That's amazing. But the thing that caught my eye is I love radiograms. My grandparents had always had radiograms. They have? Yeah. Yes, and uh, unfortunately they didn't have Bang & Olufsen, they had Rigonda Bolshoi. My grandfather liked them, he, he said that they were the best. Yeah. My parents okay. had Bang & Olufsen instead. Yeah. But uh, I always wanted my grandparents to get a Bang & Olufsen radiogram. And, uh, 
That would have been perfect. I do like the styling of the bel canto beer chords. I've never seen any other portable tape re Haven't recorders like that. They, they were, do we have one? Wow. So we've got the shavers. This, these are all different Different, this is brands. different, different yeah. brands here. We have the we have also all the other uh, shavers from yeah. my Olsen. But this is uh, um, different brands. In yes. Here. Yeah. Wow. So that's a, that's a good collection of, uh, of portable radios. That's incredible. And then... Uh, Philips TVs. Yeah. Yeah. And then. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. More yeah. radios. Right, right. Right. We've got nice. a few Philips Arena. Scandina. Scandina. Yeah. I guess you also know that brand. Yes. In this small room here. They also made some very nice products. But yes. I was, was just a little ahead. That's right. That's why. Yes. yes. And I think we've we've got to show these. They, these are they, these are really unique, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> so what have we got? TVs? Though each one is a TV, isn't it? With the... Tully, Tully, yeah. Tully, Tully. Colour. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. It's so unbelievable just to see just physically how big this, the collection is. Also, and this design is unique. Yes. You've seen it there. It's a lot of products. And so it's certainly a lot. Do you know how many items you have? We haven't um, counted them yet. No. Because uh, every week new is coming. Yeah. Um, But we guess, yeah, we guess around a thousand. Wow. There's, there's, there's more than 100 Bang Olsen televisions alone. Yeah. Yeah, and more than 500 um, uh, transfer radios. Yes. So we have yeah. around a thousand units. Yeah. That's incredible. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow. Well, thank you so much for showing me. You're welcome. Thank you welcome. for letting me see. It's nice to have some people also passionate.